All right, so what we got here is a, I don't know what year, Briggs & Stratton WMB powering a old air pump that I use to put air in the tires of my donut mobiles for out in the field there. There you go, have fun with them. I made this gas tank because I could not find one for less than my arm. And this works fine. I, that's a jam nut or a crush or whatever. So it's got the little piece in there that goes in there and that squeezes the hose. But it's not crushed really good, so it, it works. But it's just pushed in down into the tank. It, it moves. Like, it's not really as fixed in there. It just goes down to the bottom. Random muffler I put on there. Just, I don't care. And uh, this is a 70 pound pop off. It does get up to 70 and it pops off and it drops back down to 40. I'll show you when I fire it up. But also the, the frame is incomplete. Like, it's not gonna look like that. That looks like crap, but it's whatever. I was gonna make a nice steel frame of like some one inch square and then uh, slotted holes so I can adjust it and whatnot. They got a thirty thousand dollar plasma table I can cut out cut out some plates on. Oh well. And then I'll put it in a radio flyer instead of pulling it around with that cool thing. And that. <laughs> but yeah, it it runs pretty good and it pumps up fucking car tires real quick. I like it. So we choke it. Kick it. Kick it. One more. Nope. Letting me down. There we go. Oh, let's see here. Goes up to about 80. Right below 80 there. Drops back. And then yeah. Come over here. Then you can walk away. It probably takes about 40-50 seconds to, to fill up the tire. <laughs> that was completely fat, flat. There you go, look at that. Full tire. Good. Just like that. Well, there you go. Well, here. I suppose somebody get some thought about this. So whatever that is, WMB washing machine motor, I uh, bought it at a swap meet along with that pump like two weeks ago and I uh, tore the head and the oil pan off, I was checking to see if it was heavily used or not but these washing machine motors they don't get worked real that hard in dirty conditions so they usually don't have any sludge down on the bottom and then I uh, Flap the valves because they didn't do a damn thing. And uh, compression's great. I filed the points and it fired right up. But yeah, and the, the sketchy spark plug wear. Touch it, I dare you. Pull your socks off. But yeah, I, I was just sick of the. Uh, I mean, it is heavy and cumbersome. But I was sick of having to grab my little 12 volt Milwaukee tire pump from the shop, which is way over there probably about 100 yards and then uh, the battery dies and I'm over here and I'm like fucking Christ now I gotta go back to the shop get a get the other battery that is a dead also when I just put gas in this and pull it out here and I can even carry a battery with me most of these sweet 
pristine units don't have batteries in them. That's for the ether. But yeah. I don't know what else to talk about, really. Alright, have a good one.